Yeah, Mark, the math may seem simple, but it's actually a somewhat complicated equation adding up to a stressful shopping season. We can get the correct size for you and then call you when it's completed. The holiday shopping season is on at Comstock Jewelers, but owner Erin Comstock says her shop has lost some of its sparkle for workers. We'd be a great place to work. I don't know why people wouldn't want to work here. Erin's been trying to fill two full time positions for more than six months. She's willing to raise her pay to $17 an hour, but still no takers. Right now, her daughter is working the floor and her family business is very much just that. My husband, Brian Comstock, had retired but now he's like semi retired. So he's been back in. We've shortened our hours. So we're Tuesday to Saturday, 10 to five, and then we're closed Sundays and Mondays. According to the National Federation of Independent Businesses, 51% of small businesses are currently unable to fill job openings. 42% of them have had to raise their pay and 92% still couldn't find qualified workers. Much of that is because places like Amazon are raising their starting wages to $19 an hour or more. Fewer workers, fewer products, higher prices and higher wages mean lower profits. Will we see some business closures? Yep. Hart Hodges is director of the Center for Economic and Business Research at Western Washington University. He doesn't see things getting better until after the holidays. Burnout is, is going to be huge, and it's not just for the business owners. The remaining staff who are filling in for the missing staff and the owners who are filling in for the missing staff, the hours that small business owners are working right now is uh, unbelievable. Meantime, in Edmonds, we found a tea shop promising a rate of $22 an hour along with a $500 signing bonus. Businesses no longer just competing for customers. We'll make it work. It'll be easier with another person, but we'll make it work. One bright spot is economists say consumers are more than willing to start spending right now. If you're one of them, we've compiled a list of how you can help small businesses here in Edmonds as well as Mount Vernon and Bellingham. Just text the word shop to 206 448 4545 and we'll send you a link. Live in Edmonds tonight, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.